Good morning. It is Monday, May 15th, and it's going to be a great day today. I think my gas light came on as soon as I left the centers. I was running late because Jordan came down with both of his eyes matted shut. I had to give him his medicine, and then I cleared his eyes up for him. Preston didn't want to go to the center. I think it's because we turned the air on for the first time last night because I got really sick off the pollen from the trees. Still sick, but it's better, at least. Um, yeah, my gas light came on as soon as I left the sitter's house, and since I'm running late, I don't have time to get gas, so living on a prayer this morning. Living on a prayer. It's going to be a great day today. It's got to. And I have to work an extra two hours because I'm flexing because I have to take Preston to the doctor tomorrow for his, um, like, you know how they get a yearly checkup when they're little? I've forgot, completely forgot his third year one and his fourth year one is this year and I'm already, we're in June and his birthday was in March so I'm a few months late for that so mother of the year award goes to me <sighs> not lying folks well I made it through the day now I need to go get gas and then I'm going to go to the urgent care I'm spotting TMI. I apologize for that. And I'm just like out of it. And I think that could be like the head cold or sinuses or allergies or whatever the hell is going on with me. But the spotting thing kind of worries me. So um, I'm going to go get that checked out. I absolutely hate doing anything after work. I just want to go home. That's it. Just want to go home. Look at all that pretty green. So I'm done with my appointment and um, I don't have a urinary tract infection, don't have a yeast infection. They are checking my blood for thyroids, uh, thyroid issues for diabetes, and um, I think she said white cell count, I'm not sure. Um, and she also tested for STDs, which I was like, I shouldn't have any, and my husband and I have been together since we were, um, you know, like 12, so... Yeah, I mean, we haven't been doing it, but you know what I mean. So, yeah, um, I didn't want, I was like, I don't really want to do a test because I feel like I don't have it, but then there's always that, like, I don't want to find out that my husband's cheating on me either, you know? Like, I know he wouldn't do it, but everybody knows that they wouldn't do it, you know what I mean? So she tested for it. And I didn't have it, thank God. But it's just scary just like thinking of that and everything else. And then she said, um, looking into your infertility issues. And when she said your infertility, I just didn't like it. <laughs> I know that it's been, I think we're going on 26 cycles. And I know I said I would take the month off, but I still wouldn't get ex you know excited and probably test anyways. Um, I don't know what's going on. I have to wait till Thursday to find out. Um, they did do a, a urine pregnancy test and it was negative. Um, because funny enough, I spotted this weekend and then I felt like when I ovulate, I had the left pelvic pain at work today and I am due to ovulate in a week. Not now. And I was a few days early last month. So I don't know. I don't know. But when she said your infertility, that just, I don't ever want to hear infertility pertaining to me. Um, it's scary and it breaks my heart to know that I may have 
no control over not being able to have another baby. All right, so I got home and I put my pajamas on and I had someone come and pick up a coffee table and two end tables that I put on Craigslist. And I had also sold a pair of Ralph Warren tall leather boots and a pair of silver jeans. Um, so I got those packaged ready to go and also my anniversary present came my anniversary is going to be on May 21st it'll be five years and my husband got me the Casey Neistat ring it's so pretty I love it so I'm going to go take that to the store and I can barely even breathe um, they did call back with one test result I do not have diabetes so that's good so now I'm waiting on a thyroid the blood cell count, pregnancy test, I think that's it. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go take those to the store. Well, we just got back from the grocery store dropping off the packages and getting some food with the money that we, we spent exactly like $39.92, I think. Didn't get hardly anything, but it's okay. Had just enough from selling those tables, so. I am gonna go to bed. And hopefully not feel like I'm dying tomorrow. Subscribe and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.